Well, good morning. It's Wednesday morning. Hey, church tonight. Yay. <laughs> Praise God. Come and, uh, man, you know, we do worship uh, and we do testimonies. It's kind of yes. cool to hear all the testimonies you were talking about the, earlier this week about giving thanks to God. And that's one way we give thanks to God is we tell other people what that's God right. has been doing in that's our right. lives, you know. Well, it tells, and, you defeat the devil by the word of your testimony, amen, right? by the word of your testimony. Amen. Right. Amen. Well, so today our in devotion is called Entirely Faithful. And it comes from Psalms 89, verse 8. O Lord God of heaven, of heaven's armies, where is there anyone as mighty as you, O Lord? You are entirely faithful. I like that. Yeah. I've just been really bad. You know, I, uh, I'm, I know, understand what David meant. Now I'm at this age. I understand what David meant in Psalms 37, verse 5, when he said, I have been young and now I'm old, and yet I have never seen the righteous forsaken Amen. of the Lord, Praise nor, God. and I love this part, nor his seed, yes. nor his seed. So really the blessings of God, if you love God and you operate in God, the blessings of God doesn't just stop with you, Marcia. It passed down. That's What's that right. song? From generation to generation the to blessing, generations. Yeah. Amen. Amen. I love that part there. There have been so many times in our lives when you know, we have seen the faithfulness of God. I, I love to tell the story of when God directed us out of engineering to go to Bible school. And, you know, we're going to go to Waxahachie, Texas, to uh, Southwestern Assemblies God Bible College. And we were attending an AG church at that time. And, and uh, so, you know, we loaded up. Remember, we both gave two weeks notice, you know, and then we loaded, rented our house, loaded up our car and the truck and drove to Waxahachie. No place to live, no jobs, no anything, but bless God, we were moving in oh, faith. Oh, yeah, we're in <laughs> faith. We're, I'm not we, sure if faith finishes or preserves. Yeah, I'm not really sure we knew you knew what that meant at that point. But we knew that God had told us to go. You know, we knew that beyond a shadow of a doubt. And when we got there, out there on that billboard is this sign that says, where God guides, he provides. Yeah, you know? remember, because we didn't even have a place to take our furniture no, yet. We, we had no a, house. <laughs> we found a house that day. We yeah. found a duplex. Yeah, it had a hole in the floor. Yes, it yeah. did. We just stuck the refrigerator over, you know, it didn't make any difference. Didn't have anything in the refrigerator anyway. Well, not right? yet, we didn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, but God's faithfulness in every area of our lives, and that's, you know, and so it's kind of neat, Marcia, to be able at this age to tell younger people, listen, you love God, you trust God, God will be faithful in your life. God will be there in every situation for you. You know, even when it doesn't look like he's working, he's working. Even That's when right. it doesn't feel like he's working, he's working. That comes, well, that comes because we've trusted him and we've seen it him does. come through again and again and again. You know, the, my favorite song in the whole world right now is The Goodness of God. Oh, man. And it talks about his love never fails me. He's faithful. He's faithful in mm -hmm. everything and, it, and he said he holds me in the palm of his hand remember that's the part of the song that says yes. that and he's been faithful all these years and you know uh it's such an anointed song because over the years he has been faithful and he's going to be faithful until we go Amen. be with Amen. jesus and so uh, whether that be through the rapture or through death it doesn't matter he will be faithful to us because when my 94 year old uh, father Went to be with the Lord. I was so blessed because I knew yes. for 94 years, Amen. my dad had been faithful to God, but God had been even more faithful, faithful to, to him, him yes. taking Amen. care of him. Amen. And so I knew when my dad transitioned from this world into heaven, it was a beautiful thing because Absolutely. of the faithfulness of God. Amen. And that's what it's going to be for me. Well, it'll be for you if you Amen. keep serving him. Amen. Amen. You know, you just go back to the word of God and you read so many uh, about so many people and how God has was faithful to them. I, I always love uh, da uh, David and Goliath. That's one of my favorite stories, you know. And, uh, you know, how God just took that which he had, he had won before and used to win in the trouble before and used the same thing to win in that one right there. No matter what the attack of the enemy is. Exactly. He's exactly. faithful. He does not leave us nor forsake us. It's like you said, he, he's working when we don't even see he's working. Yeah, he, That's how faithful God is. Marcia, in 1 Samuel 17, David says this to here. He says, um, 
the same God. Yes. He, I like that. The same God that delivered me out of the paw of the lion and the paw of the bear will deliver me out of the hand Hallelujah. of the giant. The same God. That's that is the faithfulness of God right there. I so love no that. matter what you're going through, <laughs> He's delivered you before. Oh, yes. And He's gonna do it again. He'll do it again. And he'll and do what it you're again. Saying, Let me read this last verse the, here. The, 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 Psalms eighty nine, verse one and two. I will sing of the Lord's unfailing love forever. Young and old will hear of your faithfulness. Yes, your unfailing love will last forever. Your faithfulness is enduring as the heavens. Can I pray this prayer there for you right now? Would you just pray this with me? Father God, thank you for your faithfulness and your goodness. I can trust you to come through for me because it's who you are. Lord, you know what I'm facing right now. Help me to see your hand upon my life. Strengthen me and revive me through the truth of your word. Thank you. I choose to trust you today because you are entirely faithful. I do so in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Praise God. God bless you. Hope to see you tonight's service. God bless.